I'm thinking of the incredible breakthrough which has been made possible by developments in communications, particularly the transistor and, above all, the communications satellite. These things will make possible a world in which we can be in instant contact with each other, wherever we may be. It will be possible in that age, perhaps only 50 years from now, for a man to conduct his business from Tahiti or Bali just as well as he could from London. In fact, if it proves worthwhile, almost any executive skill, any administrative skill, even any physical skill, could be made independent of distance. When that time comes, the whole world will have shrunk to a point, and the traditional role of the city as a meeting place for man would have ceased to make any sense. In fact, men will no longer commute, they will communicate. Prisoner and held captive within the digital world of the computer itself. cellular phone to order me a pizza. And that includes 50 minutes of their time. We'll pay you. Well, it's very hip to be on the internet right now. Hack the planet! Hack the planet! And I still think Apple has a future. The way out is not to slash and burn, it's to innovate. Oh, okay, here's what I think. Mike, super simple. Hit him with the good news, bad news routine. Good news, bad news routine, right? They're gonna say good, Mike. What? Everything's gonna be fine. We still have the U.S. robotics deal. We're like, uh, what did the the cave say about Aladdin? Diamond in the rough. Oh, fuck. What? I forgot the easel. Ah, oh, we have to change the name. Product needs a new name. Give that guy way too much credit, man. He hasn't seen Star Wars. He's bald. How much you want to bet that you don't even mention the phone? <laughs> 